Hi everyone, my name is Candace Corris Logue, Vice President, Banking Center Manager at People's Bank, and you're watching Ask the Expert. As crazy as inflation is right now, let's talk about the variety of savings accounts that we have to offer and how we can help you make your money work better. A basic savings account has a variety of features. First one may be a minimum required balance to keep in the account. And how to invest in that savings account? Well, get your piggy banks out. Empty out your piggy banks, take your birthday money or graduation money and place them in a savings account with minimal interest. Another type of savings account is a money market. Now, money markets may require a higher balance to be maintained in the account, but the benefit, you're earning a little bit more interest. Savings accounts and money markets are both federally regulated, so you are limited to six electronified withdrawals per month. If you do exceed those, you may incur a fee with your institution. Another type of investment is a certificate of deposit, or CD. Now, the difference between these and the money markets and savings accounts is that you do require a higher balance to be tied up in the account, which means you can't access these funds at any time. If you do break that contract, you may incur a fee with your financial institution. Now you've heard about three different types of savings accounts, the basic savings, a money market, and a CD. And you may be questioning yourself, which one is best for me? If you're able to stockpile some of that cash that you don't need, then I would recommend a certificate of deposit. But if you need it liquid so you can access it just in case something comes up, I would recommend a savings or a money market. If you're interested in opening a savings, money market, or certificate of deposit, please visit the nearest banking centers for People's Bank. We look forward to seeing you.